Right, we are looking at this question in front of us. And uh, Peter's mother is twice his age. 14 years ago, she was four times his age. How old are they both now? We're interested in knowing the uh, age of Peter and the age of the mother as well. The age of Peter's mother as well. Right, and therefore, we analyze this question and understand that we are to find two answers to this. Right, Peter's age and uh, Peter's mother's age as well. Okay, awesome stuff. And this is very, very clear. And to solve this problem, we proceed as follows. So what do we then do? We let. We proceed to let X be equal to Peter's age. Right, this is Peter's age. And Y is equal to the mother's age. Y is the mother's age. Right, the first part of the question says Peter's mother is twice his age. So in other words, if we look at the mother and Peter, we understand that the mother is twice his age and therefore to effect an equality here, we multiply this by two and equate the two parts. Okay, like, like so. Okay, now we proceed to uh, break down the second part of the question. 14 years ago, she was four times his age. Right, so if you go back 14 years, which means we'll say y minus 14 and also x minus 14. But if that is the case, um, she was four times um, his age. And therefore, if the mother was four times and this was the for one, and therefore we must multiply uh, the right hand side by four and put an equality there to equate the two parts. Okay. This is good, but very, very good. Okay, right. So the first part of the equation, call it, or the first equation, call it equation one. The second one, call it equation two. We proceed to solve these two equations simultaneously. These are simultaneous equations. How do we solve them? We're going to use substitution. We can use the elimination method as well. And we then say put. Put one into two. Right, so if you put equation one into equation two, meaning wherever there is y, you put two x because y equals two x. So we're going to have, therefore, two x minus 14. Right, two x minus 14, which equals four into x minus 14. 4 into x minus 14. This is therefore 2x minus 14 equals 4x minus 56. And uh, what then we're having therefore is if you bring 56 to the other side, it becomes 56 minus 14, which is 42. Okay. Now we have 4x minus 2x, which is 2x, like so. Right, so this is therefore 2x equals 42, which means x is 21. If x is 21, hence y is equal to 2x x is 21, and this is 42. Right. Thus, what do we then say? Thus, Peter, Peter is uh, 21 years 
old. Twenty-one years old now. Right. And Peter's mother. Right. Peter's mother is forty-two years. Old. Like so. Thus, Peter is 21 years old now, and Peter's mother is 42 years old. Okay. And this is the solution to the problem. You can see that Peter is. 21 years old, and uh, Peter's mother is 42 years old. We have solved uh, this problem in a step-by-step -step manner. Thank you so much, everybody, for your time and attention, and goodbye to you.